touching my tree right now. It's like I'm wearing pajamas, but I can't breathe. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Whoops. <laughs> if you're new to this channel, please subscribe. It's that red button down below, so subscribe on it. If you want to join the family, please do. I'm just going to get straight into it because, I mean, who really watches introductions? Like, honestly, I feel like a lot of people exit within, like, five seconds of the video. So if you have passed the this few seconds, you have a good attention span. Part one of my Shein haul is out. If you guys haven't watched it already, please do. The link is in the bio. Watch it after this video, please. The first and probably my favorite piece from this haul are these shades. I feel like everyone needs to get themselves a pair of these sunnies. It was cheap and it's really sturdy, I promise. Highly recommend. It's just a nice accessory to wear on your head if you don't really like the shape on your face or wear it, you know, depending on how you want to wear it. You can wear it on your face. Yeah, I don't think there's any protection from these sunnies but it's just literally for fashion so uh, keep that in mind when you're gonna buy this this is literally just a fashion statement so but i mean it looks cool anyway so it's fine i'm cool with that it looks pretty good right <laughs> subscribe <laughs> so next is this jumper i don't know i kind of look like i'm matching my tree right now like with this whole design here in the middle i'm actually not a fan Personally, I just feel like it looks a bit tacky. I don't know. It's not my vibe. I'm not really digging this, um, to be completely honest with you guys. You know what, though? If you're looking for something, like, cheap and fleece, it does have fleece. I'll give them that. This is a large, by the way, and I wanted it to sit more oversized, but it's not really that oversized, like, at all. It looks like it fits more like a small, you know, if you really want it oversized, oversized. I don't recommend getting this because this is already the biggest size that they have and it sits on me just right, I would say. Not not oversized. I feel like it's just not my style. Like, at all. It's just not it. I'm really disappointed because I had high hopes for this. I'll show you guys the photo of how it looks like. That's how it's meant to look like. And it doesn't look like that on me. <laughs> I just look like I'm wearing pajamas, to be honest. The plus side is that it has pockets. As you guys can tell, it's got some pockets, which is it's all right, it's all right. So if you're into velvet and, you know, into flare browns, I would recommend this because it's really comfy, but I just feel like it's just not my thing. It's just not something I can get with. I just feel like it's meant to be for someone taller than me. I am 5'1", by the way. And it's just a bit too long. It's just a bit too, like, daggy on my body type and my height. I would rate this like a 2 out of 10. <laughs> On me anyways. They're going back to Shein. Someone else can have them. I don't want them. Oh, if I'm feeling a bit professional, I can wear these pants. They got pockets too, so that's a win. You guys know, we always look for pockets in like in a pair of pants or even a dress. If a dress or a pair of pants has pockets, then we're winning really. I feel like maybe now I look like, you know, I have a teaching degree. If you guys didn't know, I do have a teaching degree. I'm just not teaching. So, like, I feel like this whole outfit is literally teacher vibes. I rate this a 8 out of 10. Like, I would say the fabric isn't the best, but you also get what you pay for. I think it was under $20, so it's a steal for a pair of pants. God, I can't breathe. Not that I can't breathe, my legs can't breathe. If I sit any lower than this, I feel like they would rip. Like, I'm that uncomfortable. So tight on my thighs. Oh my god. It does not fit right. I do like them. Maybe I have to size up. It makes my butt look perky. Like, whoa. Like, where did this come from? Even my leggings don't make my butt look this good. Like, what? <laughs> um, hello. If you guys want a pair of plaid pants that is affordable, I recommend them, but I definitely recommend sizing up or two, like maybe get both, like one size up and two sizes up, just in case. I feel like I would rate this a 7 out of 10, like it would be higher if it fit me right. I feel like the quality isn't the greatest, it's pretty thin I would say. It's not the best pant material, it kind of low-key feels like pajamas, <laughs> but they look good. So. That's something you're gonna have to like work with if you want 
it to look nice but also got to take into consideration that the fabric isn't exactly the best quality i would say if i had to rate the fabric of this the fabric would be like a four out of ten and i just feel like it won't last you that long if you're looking for like a long-term investment for a pair of pants i wouldn't recommend getting these i feel like it will just wear out after like a few washes i love them though they're very cute i like them i like them a lot i'm actually obsessed with these i like guys they look so good. I wanted a pair of brown pants because I feel like brown is very in this season. I like them. You just heard like my shoes squeaking. I'm sorry. These were really affordable considering, you know, the quality of these pants. They're really cute and they're very flattering. So I'd rate these a 8 out of 10. Highly recommend. So you know how vests are in season right now, they're very trendy. So I thought, why not jump on the bandwagon as well? And I really don't like how it looks on me, I'm not gonna lie. Like, look at the shoulders, it's just not cut right. It doesn't have the oversized look. I just don't like it, guys, I really don't. See a trend here, guys, another brown moment. I love this, it's really comfy. I would say it's not the best quality, but for the price, I would say it's pretty decent. I think I would rate this an 8 out of 10. Not too bad. Okay, so this top is really cute. I love the color, except you guys, oh, I'm really frustrated because the quality isn't the greatest. It's very itchy and it's not very stretchy. And I'm just very disappointed because I love the fit of it. But sadly, I won't be keeping it. And I would say it's a six out of 10. Now this jumper was so cute and look how affordable it is, guys. It's only $16. But the quality, again, is very disappointing, I would say. So I would rate it a 5 out of 10. Just not a fan. And that is all for me. I hope you guys like this video. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!